Hello. How are you? Yeah, we back. Got more stuff to show you today. So, let's begin. Today, we're going to start off with Beryl. B-E-R-Y-L. Main component or mineral found in this is beryllium. Hence where it gets its name Beryl from. Mohs hardness 7.5 to 8. Do not tumble this with your um, quartzes, amethyst or anything because it's harder. You will scratch it. Beryl. Over here I have some pieces that have some black crystals on it that I don't know the location of those crystals. Beryl. This over here is Brazilian agate nodules. You see the lines. This one is a black skin. Agate is, a, is in the quartz family. This is very dense, very heavy. These two agates together are at least a pound. Now over here, I have two stones in here. They're sitting in water, relaxing. This is called a Koyamito agate. Koyamito agate. Agate. Yes. And under it, in here, let's go here. This is purple. Chalcedony or Chalcedony, Chalcedony. You say tomato, I say tomato. Chalcedony, I mean, excuse me, Chalcedony. Purple Chalcedony. It's related to the agate, it's related to the carnelian. This is a Koyamoto agate I'm showing you. Yes. Let's get down here into this carnil I mean, excuse me, Chalcedony. As you see, there's a nice crystal cluster here of quartz. Yeah, right there, that bug. That is purple chalcedony of the salvia type. Here you go, better view. I got agate sitting in water, trying to shake loose some of that sediment. Over here. Over here we have azurite and malachite. The green that you see is the malachite. The blue, that rich dark blue, is azurite. Azurite. 
beautiful rich blue and I know you see in the background there another rock with some blue in it this is called lapis lazuli that's what I call it lapis lazuli lapis lazul l-a-p-i-s l-a-z-u-l-i most hardness scale of a 5.5 oh yeah the malachite and azurite are from anywhere from a 3.5 to a 5 because the two of them have different hardnesses but as you see it's on the face of that rock this is the lapis lazuli the gold that you see or this brassy color is pyrite a lot of lapis comes with pyrite on it the blue from the lapis is from azurite Just too close in there All right. none of these stones are washed yet so you don't really get to see it's a beautiful stone so thank you for sitting with me, enduring with me, geology, rocks, they are an uh, ever learning, ever learning thing, you never know everything, always learning. Always learning. I just love the way agate looks when it's wet. gonna tumble some of these others are I'm not I'm gonna cut some and see what we get from there you have a great day it has definitely definitely been fun